I will record. Yeah, it says grammar conjunctions. Uh, to, to start, we can say these are grammar conjunctions. Okay, conjunctions. What does conjunctions mean? How do you understand by conjunctions? What does it mean? Conjugaciones, teacher. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Tania. Okay. So in English, in English we have, as in Spanish, we have the the grammar categories. We can say the the grammar categories, and these grammar categories are divided in groups, okay? One is subject, verb, uh, or we can say in place of subject, we're going to say noun, nouns, verbs, adjectives, adverbs, articles, okay? Noun, verbs, adjectives, adverbs, articles, and conjunctions, conjunctions. Okay, so we have this and we are working with conjunctions. And as a conjunctions, we have now both, both, what else? Both, neither, either, both. Neither, either. Those are conjunctions, okay? This, these words belongs, belongs, pertenece, belongs to conjunctions. Either, both, neither, okay? As articles, do you remember? A, and, and de, definite, indefinite article. Adverbs, adverbs, we can say, uh, as adverbs, well, frequently, okay, uh, generally, adverbs, always, sometimes, never, do you remember? Adverbs, okay, the, the frequency, adverbs, no, frequency, adverbs we have, or well, so fast, they are, adjectives, Adjectives, as adjectives, we have good, excellent, fantastic, and so on. Verbs, verbs, regular or irregular, regular or irregular adjet, adverbs. Okay, sorry. Regular or irregular verbs. Modal verbs, so a lot of verbs. Nouns, we can say proper nouns, common nouns, proper nouns, common nouns, and so on. Okay, you know, uh, that is the grammar part, that is the grammar that is divided in different, in different categories. Now, we are working with this conjunctions, okay, conjunctions. What does it mean? What is the, the, the function of conjunctions? It's to link, link two ideas. What does link mean? What does link mean? What does link? Enlace. Enlace. Yes, link, okay? Link or join. We can say link, join, connect. Yeah, that is. That is the function of a conjunction. Both, neither, either. Link, connect, join, two ideas, two words. Okay? 
So this is the, the function, function of conjunction. And we are learning that, okay? It says conjunctions, both, neither, either. Okay, and you told me the meaning. Yeah, that's the meaning, okay? Both, neither, either. Great. Now it says, look at, look at the active grammar box and complete the rules. Complete the rules with both, neither, or either. Complete. How? Both, both here, here, or here. Where? Neither, the same, A, B, or C. Either, A, B, or C. Where? Where does it belong? Both men try to catch the ball. Neither, neither man got all the money. I don't think either man should get any money. So study and tell me where, where does it belong? Donde pertenece, where does it belong? ABC. You have one minute. Then we're going to figure it out. So agree. Okay, yeah, it says, use, use both, neither, either, when talking about two things or people. Use, that is the instruction, use both, neither, either, when talking about two, Two, one, two, two things or people. An example, here we have both, both men. Says both men. So one and two men, plural. Both men try to catch the ball. Okay, two. In this case, two people, two people. Both men, men, plural. Okay, the other example, neither, neither, neither man, neither man, okay, so it refers to, to people too, neither man got all the money, okay, it refers people too, I don't think, I don't think either man should get any money. Also refers people. Okay, that's why it says use both, neither, either, when talking about two things or people. Here we have the rule, neither, sorry, either, either, mean, one or the other means one or the other. I don't think either man, I don't think either man should get any money. Either means one or the other, okay? Both, both, both means one is the other. So both means one and the other, both, as you said at the, at the beginning, ambos. Neither, neither means not one, not one, it's negative, not one, 
and not the other. Okay, not one, not the other. We are going to continue giving examples. Two, both, neither, and neither can, can be followed. What does followed mean? What does followed mean? Sí. Sí. Siguiendo. Seguido. Seguido. Both, neither, and neither can be can be followed by of of plus pronoun plus pronoun or or option or the these etc Plus a noun, another structure, plus a noun. Example, of, it says, of plus pronoun. Neither, neither of, look at, neither of the men. In this case, it's a noun, men, it's not a pronoun. Neither of, neither of men, neither of men got the money. Neither of, neither of men get the money. Okay, so this is how we use, says, either, both, neither. Okay, that is the way how we use these three conjunctions. Conjunctions, either, both, neither. Okay. Now, complete the sentences with both, neither, and either. Either means one or the other. Both means one and the other. N, look at. N or here is not. Neither means not one and not the other. Okay. Number one. Number one. Complete the sentences with both, neither or either. Of my two best friends. Is married yet? Of both. my both? Sí, just each. Okay, both. Yeah, we can use both. Both of both both of my two best friends is married yet. Okay, number two. Number two. No problem if you make a mistake. Both. Both, both two, okay. Both. Number three. Number three. What do you have in number three? Neither. 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 Four. Either. Either. Five. Neither. 
Neither. Neither. Oh, we have two options. And somebody says neither. Which one? I prefer, <clears throat> now let's read. <clears throat> yeah. Both, both of my two best friends is married yet. Mm, agree or disagree? Correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Both of my parents have always worked. Both of my parents have always worked. Correct. Neither of them is tired yet. Neither. Neither of them is tired yet. Correct. For either, for either, uh, sorry, let's see, let's see either a movie or a play. Let's see, let's see either a movie or a play. Five, I prefer, I prefer a play, but Either is okay for me. Correct. Not neither. Why not neither? Because of but. I prefer a play. This. This sentence is affirmative. Okay. The first sentence. Uh, means affirmative. I prefer a play. I prefer a play. Sorry. This is affirmative. I prefer a play. Yeah. But says, but it's uh, introducing. It's, we can say a con contract. But either it's okay, but it is okay for me. Not neither. Okay. What about in number one? What about in number one? It's not as you said. So what was in number one? What was in number one? Neither teacher? Yes. Neither. Neither of my two best friends is married yet. Do you remember yet in negative sentences? Yet in negative sentences. And so that's why. Neither. What does it mean, neither? Neither. Yes. Neither of my best friends. Neither of my two best friends is married yet. Neither. Okay. Another thing. Both, both of my parents have always, no problem, right, with both. Both of my parents have always worked. Both. Okay. Here are the same three. Neither, neither of them is retired yet, negative. Yet. Neither. Also means ninguno, right? Of them, in this case is followed. Of them, pronoun is retired yet. Let's see. Let's see, either a movie or a play. What does it mean, either, in this case? What does either mean in this context?
What does either mean in this context? Number four, let's see either a movie or a play. No idea, what does it mean? Let's see a movie, let's see either a movie or a play, friends. Let's, let's travel, for example, let's travel either. Let's travel either. To Cochabamba, to Cochabamba, or uh, Santa Cruz. Let's travel either. Let's, let's travel either to Cochabamba or Santa Cruz. Okay. Maybe when you translate one by one, it appears. Cualquiera. Okay, let's travel either to Cochabamba or Santa Cruz, but sometimes it doesn't appear in translation. In this case, we mean, oh, okay, let's travel either. Okay, either. So to choose this or this, no problem. I prefer, I prefer a play, but either it's okay for me. The same. I prefer a play, but either it's okay for me. Cualquiera está bien. Okay, I prefer, but either it's okay for me. Okay, to give more example, any questions? Okay, I will give more examples. I will give more examples. Before, before giving more examples, I want you to see, see this reference on page 100. Or do you want me to give you the example? Then let me give you the examples. And you have tried, tried to understand in Spanish. Okay. I wasn't recording. Okay, um, Jan, that is both, both plural, both Nelson and Carlos. I, I can say, look at, for example, in this part. Both, both Amalia and Celia are working, are working now, both because that's why they are not in the class. Both Amalia and Celia are working now. Or not. That's why they are not here. Yeah. Both Amalia and Celia are working now. Both. Both accept plural, neither singular. And here we can say both, both, both of Amalia and Celia pronoun, both of them are working now. Yeah. Nelson and Carlos, Nelson and Carlos are Bolivia. Both of them are Bolivian. Both Amalia and Celia are working now. Both of them are working now. Another example, with neither, neither Nelson nor Carlos is Spanish. Neither of them is Spanish. Neither Amalia nor Celia is in the class. Neither of them is in the class. Neither of them is in the class. Okay. 
do do you do you study do you study with either do you study with either amalia do you study either with amalia or celia question do you live uh, sorry do you study with do you study with either of them another example you can say i i don't study with with either i don't study with either amalia amalia or celia I don't study with either Amalia or Celia. What does it mean? What does it mean I don't study with either Amalia or Celia? Eh, no estudio ni con Amalia ni con Celia. <laughs> yes. Yes, that means I don't study. I don't study with either with either of them yeah that is okay uh another thing look at neither sorry either neither neither uses nor in the verb in singular either either connects with or or okay the same here in questions Okay, do you live with either Nelson or Carlos? Do you live with either of them? When you use the nouns, con, con, conjunction is or with either. And when you use either in a in sentence, sentence, not question, negative is necessary. I don't either, I don't. I don't live with either Nelson or Carlos. Also, you are using or, but negative. I don't live. I don't live with either. The same here, I don't study, as Tania was saying. I don't study with either Amalia or Celia. Okay, so use or. Use or with either. Okay. Use or. Not nor. Okay. Not nor. No. Or is here. And neither, neither, you use nor. Nor here. When you connect and not or, use nor to say ni. Here, also you're saying me. I don't study. No estudio con Amalia, ni. But use or, that means me. Okay, yeah, to finish. To finish, let's, let's move to this other, to the book. Here it says, the book says, go to this page. Page. 126, page 126. We have here also neither either, here conjunctions, more examples. Oh, sorry. Oh no, what happened? Yeah, there we have also neither either. Yeah, there is. Yeah, we have here, look at conjunctions, both, neither, either. Both, neither, either, we have, and it says, both, neither, either. Use both, neither, either to talk about two people or two things. Example, both jackets, 
both jackets are expensive. Neither jacket fits me very well. I don't like either jacket. Yeah. What does it mean? What does both jackets are expensive mean in Spanish, guys? What does it mean? Hurry up. Both jackets are expensive. Ambas jacket, jacketas son caras? Yes, both jackets. Yeah, both jackets. Jackets, we are going to understand chamadas, taco, eh, something like that. Chaquetas, yeah. Neither, neither jacket, look at, neither jacket fits me very well. What does it mean? Fits me, in Spanish, queda. Neither jacket fits me very well. What does it mean? Ninguna chaqueta me queda bien. Yes. Negative, look at negative. I don't like either jacket. I don't like either jacket. I don't like either jacket. What does it mean? No me gusta ninguna chaqueta. Tampoco me gusta esta chaqueta. Tampoco. Yeah. No, no, no. In this case, it will mean. I don't like ninguna, ninguna chaqueta. Al decir, I don't like ninguna chaqueta, no estamos hablando de una, estamos hablando de una o dos, de dos o más, mejor dicho. ¿No ve? A ver, imagínense, I don't like either jacket, no me gusta ninguna chaqueta. That's why, por eso dice, use both neither either to talk about two two people or things here look at both jackets plural neither singular neither jacket fits neither jacket fits me i don't like either jacket here we have more example use <clears throat> use both with plural noun. Ahí está. Use, use both with a plural noun. It means one and the other. Significa el otro, uno o el otro. Use neither, use neither with a singular noun. It means not one, not the other. In the both es esta o la otra. In neither, ninguna. Ni esta, ni la otra. Use either with a singular. También es singular después de either. Use either with a singular noun. It means uno, one, or the other. Uno o el otro. Neither es ninguna. Either tienes la opción, esta o la otra. Both, ambas. Ok. So, when, when you use both, neither, either, plus, plus of, you also need, you also need, ¿qué necesita? Need de these, those, my, your, his, etc. Pronoun, pronombres, fíjense, article, pronoun. If, you, if, if a noun follows, it must be plural. If, if a noun follows, it must be a plural. Okay? So, this is the rule, what you have to follow. Okay, ahí está el resumen, that is the summarizing part. Both plural, neither, singular, 
que significa ni una ni la otra, either, una puede ser, ¿no? One or the other. Ok. Ok, my friend, that's it for today. Uh, I think it's very late. I know. Yeah, I, I was recording now. I was recording. I will upload the 